A family in Niagara-on-the-Lake is shaken over an attack on their family dogs this week by two German shepherds. The family says their dogs are lucky to be alive and they're concerned for others in the neighborhood. Al Sweeney joins us live with the details on the story. Shocking story, Al. Yeah, Taz, it is surprising and a warning. The video we're going to show you is graphic. Now, the family says a German shepherd from across the street tried to bite one of them once before. And then this week on Tuesday, that dog and another attacked their dogs. Here's how it looked. This 10-year-old Border Terrier mix named Gunner is at home recovering from his injuries after being attacked this week by the two much larger dogs, with one of the German shepherds sinking its teeth into his throat. It's right around here where it happened. A family dog ran into one of the German shepherds that was loose on their property on Tuesday, and the family security video shows what happened. <laughs> then the other shepherd showed up and Gunner arrived. The shepherd held on to Gunner's throat for more than a minute. At one point, both shepherds were attacking him. Then he was dragged away into a neighboring vineyard when one of the homeowners saw what was happening. If they dragged him into the grapes, they were going to kill him. Gunner's owner, Colleen Petrunik, says the attack ended when the owner of the German shepherds arrived from across the street. She says the neighbors apologized and paid the vet bill more than $1,000 but they're still worried, especially about young children. Are my grandkids safe in the yard now if they happen to wander over? My daughter gets the school bus from here, and it's right in between our driveway and their driveway, and I'm like constantly on edge looking around. The Lincoln County Humane Society has stepped in. As a result of our investigation, we deemed the two attacking dogs dangerous under the Niagara and the Lake bylaw, and we laid three charges against the owner of those dogs. The owner of the Shepherds has been fined $350 and ordered to muzzle the dogs. And if it happens again, penalties could be more severe. It could potentially be taking the dogs away or issuing the, the court would issue fines in that case. We talked to the owners of the German Shepherds today. They wouldn't go on camera and the dogs weren't around, but they were concerned that publicity around the dog attack could damage their local business. While Gunner's owners are living in fear. I'm terrified. I, I, I'm, I'm scared to go out now. So Gunner's owners say the neighbors have told them they're going to retrain the German shepherds so that this doesn't happen again. Gunner's owners aren't certain that that's going to resolve the problem. 